Right, what's in this boiler? So obviously we've got wires. I in the alley, I think that went as last time. We've got a bit more. We've got aluminium here. This is non-stick. That's non-stick. That's non-stick. Obviously the cases. Right, let's see what I get out of it. Obviously, I've got to cut these off, but I'll do that another time. Right.
Right guys, I bought myself a face mask just to be on the safe side. Right, my battery died. My battery died, so I've cut that off <clears throat> so I can make more room. I'm now in the middle of cutting this off so I can see what's actually inside it. It's starting to annoy me now. Right, so I got it off. I got that burnery bit. Bit of alley. Bit more. Bit more of that motory thing. Got that. I got the heat exchange. Ignore that other little bit there. That's off the dryer. Oh, and I found that on the dryer. Ain't got a clue what that is. I've never seen one of them before. Or I've never found one before. And then I got that bit of brass and copper. So not much out of it. Get loads and loads out of it, guys. But every little helps, as Tesco say. Right, guys, there's the van now. Ready for tomorrow to go and empty. Right guys, that's me done. Morning guys, 30th of March, nearly 20 past eight. Gonna go and empty. Come with us. Right guys, I'm going to empty this early because I've got a funny feeling it's gonna be busy. Because obviously yesterday was Good Friday. So, uh, Let's go and see what we get with it. Just as I thought, there's two vans outside waiting, so inside's full. Let's see how long it takes us. It's now 25 to nine. Thank <laughs> you. 
So I went in with mixed steel, 220 kilos, 165 pound a ton. I got 36 pound 30. Right, let's go and see what else we can find. Come with us.
money with the fire. Two baking trays and two pans. Just been given that car battery. Summer when it's summer. nice. Exactly, exactly. To yeah. be fair, I had one, never used it. I, um, I, mean, I you... had it with all intentions. Got an handle on it now. Yeah, got a handle on it. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Some people don't. <laughs> they say I'm not funny. No, it is funny. Do you want me to hold it up a bit? No. It's better like that. Sure, exercise today, isn't it? Yeah. You wouldn't believe I've just got back from the gym where I've been on one of these and I've got one at home. I don't like doing that. Why pay for it when you've got one? Exactly. <laughs> <sighs> Women. You've got to be in the zone though, haven't you? Yeah, of course you have. And it helps at a gym. Of course it does. Well, it's shaking. I'm doing it because I'm doing it. You think, oh God, I can't get out of it. Yeah, yeah. exactly. There we go with it. No, thank you. Another bike. Right, there's the back of the van. I'm gonna rejig it. Right. Is it worth scrapping? So, I've done my sums, and this month I have earned one thousand one hundred and ninety four pounds and fifty eight pence. That's what come in. What went out was nine hundred and six pounds and five pence. So my total for this month was two hundred and eighty eight pounds and fifty three pence. Now I know every month I'm not going to MOT the van. Uh, I'm not going to buy a grinder. Um, not going to have it welded. So that price will go up because obviously I've spent money on the van for its MOT. I've spent money on welding. I bought a grinder. 
cordless one so I can hit stuff whilst I'm out. Um, so we'll see what next month brings. Right, guys. I've had a few people asking me about how do they donate. Uh, I haven't got a clue. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask a mate if he can set up PayPal for me um, and then add it to a video or something. Somebody was saying something about PayPal on the live earlier. Um, so I, I'm going to do that or see if he can do that. Um, just so people can donate if they wish because I've had a few people asking now about donations and what have you which I'm really really surprised at because I never thought anybody would want to um, donate to a, a scrap man and I appreciate that so I'm gonna see if I can set that up right guys I'm gonna call it a day there now and I'll see you all on the next one. Ta-da for now.